Hello and welcome to my try to teach you something about fachspezifische Informationstechnik, yeah. topic specific information technology. First of all, why I'm doing this in English? Yeah. This topic, this topic at school is a so called CLIL, CLIL topic, Content Language Integrated Learning. So this means you should hear something in English. Yeah. Please be aware of that my English is not the best. Yeah. So you will for sure hear wrong pronunciation, you will for sure hear wrong grammar. However, you should get used to, to, to talking English, understanding English and so on. Yeah. This is the reason for CLIL. Correct English you will learn in your English lessons. Yeah. Here it's, I call it always construction site English. Yeah. So like I talked all my, all my professional career on some construction sites over the world. Uh, main thing here is that we understand each other. Yeah. And this, is, this should, be, should be the goal also of this type of 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 teaching okay so that's the reason why i'm doing this in english and not in german okay next thing you should know is uh there's a series of 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 videos for the different topic of fachspezifische informationstechnik the first topic is here is arduino topic okay i will just record my videos I will not cut them, speed them up or something like this yeah? because even if I run into problems we see how to solve them on the fly and how long it takes and so on I don't really have the, the, the need of looking perfect okay for me the most important thing is that we're we're learning something here yeah and of course if something happens yeah then something happens and then it will get resolved and then you will see it on the video and if the same thing happens to you you know already how to react okay so how do we start yeah. we start with a starter kit with an arduino starter kit it turned out that this, uh, I do not want to make an advertisement or something like this. Uh, you can buy whatever you like. Yeah? My recommendation is this, uh, the most complete starter kit from Iligo, Iligo, Ilichu, I don't know how to pronounce it. Yeah? There is a basic starter kit, there's a super starter kit, and there's this most complete starter kit. We will use this most complete starter kit because simply it does have RFID uh, items with it. Okay. Uh, this one we will use during the lessons. Or well, this one the lessons are based on. Like I said, you can buy whatever you like. The most complete starter kit with Uno. Yeah, that's maybe important to know because some or up to now one person bought a Mega R3 uh, start uh, most complete starter kit Mega. Yeah, and this is a different different type of controller. Does not really matter too much. However, uh, standard is this Uno Uno starter kit. Yeah, you can order it wherever you, wherever you like. Up to now, we may we had pretty pretty good uh, experience with this. Yeah, up to now we had around 150 of the starter kits used, and each of it worked simply. Okay, how does the thing look like if you receive it? You receive it should look like something like this, yeah? a packet 
it's uh, boistered, gepolstered, with air bubbles inside so that it cannot get hurt. And yeah, if you receive it, you can open it, and it's always yes, it's always it's always like Christmas. Yeah. There's also written if the seal on the bubble pack is damaged, please or peeled off, please reject because it seems like somebody really likes to steal something out of these of these of these packages. I'm not I'm not sure if we really got this if we really had this issue in school. Ah. Okay. That's it for doing it with care. Yeah. Now I do it. Okay. It's open. Of course, I turned it the wrong way. Whoop. It may look like this. Yeah. May look like this. What do we have here? Uh, we have this most complete starter kit. If you open your kit, and uh, Achtung! Wow, there are really a lot of things inside. Yeah, so you have some thank you note. This wood away. We don't need it. Or yeah, lucky to help. We have some CD-ROM. There are also uh, things uh, on site. There are data sheets of all these things on site. There are also some uh, different uh, programming ideas on on this sheet uh, on this on this CD-ROM. You can use it. Yeah. However, in the in in the curse, maybe we use the maybe we use the data sheets, but it's not really not really necessary okay so that's for this and the rest the rest is really everything we need to program our little controller yeah our little controller and all the other electronic parts this is the controller here and they are packed in such anti-static packages yeah? of course you will have to open them uh, you will have to open them uh, and and then we will make some exercise with it there are different parts inside it right now it looks pretty overwhelming let's say if you're not used to look at these things yeah uh, however during our our curse we will touch most of the topics which are inside here this one will be interesting. This is this RFID topic. This is interesting. We have here a little box with a lot of things inside, LEDs and, and different different small bugs with a lot of legs and so on. We'll get used to it. We even have a gyroscope here. We do have ah, no. we do have step drivers, we do have ultrasonic measurement modules, we do have and this is always always uh, I don't exactly know why but you know uh, joystick with button fire 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 forward back we'll get we'll get to this yeah there's a battery inside this is the only thing where I would say uh, probably this is already empty this happened to the most of the starter kits that these batteries are empty yeah. there is noise sensor here we do have a real-time clock for instance yeah there are several little things we will uh, program there's a little servo motor there's a little DC motor there's a little stepper motor there is a remote control there are displays inside and so on uh, this is the thing we are using. Okay. Different cables, different lengths of cables, different colors of cables, 
jumper wires, USB cables and so on. Encoders here, infrared sensors, peer sensors, movement sensors. What do we have here? Uh, digit display, one digit, four digit, this is four digit. Uh, then we do have here a relay, yeah, like I said, and we also have some power supply module, which is inside, like I said, this is the, this is this most complete starter kit, most of the things we are going to use in there, yeah, if we're not covering every, everything which is inside there, you have also this this uh, CD, yeah. You also have this CD. We will. You can look on. There are trainings also for all of these items here. Yeah. So, first thing we want to do in our next video is to see. I mean, now we see a lot of stuff. Yeah, a lot of wires, a lot of electronics and so on but I already said we were using a so-called UNO it's a microcontroller what such a microcontroller or what what a controller is and especially what is the UNO or what does control mean and what is UNO what is the Arduino UNO this will be addressed in the next video okay so in the next video you are uh, you get a Kickstarter, Jumpstarter, or, or or basic information. Let's call it basic information. Maybe that's the best best word for this. So you will get the basic information of what are we dealing with. Yeah? And then we will start to, to, to install the software on our PC. Then we will write our first lines of code, download, see if the download is working. And then we will address digital inputs and digital outputs. And then we will do analog inputs and analog outputs and 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 so on okay and then once we have these these things once we master these things we can use all of these items here if we master analog in and outputs we can master all the other things also or digital digital and analog in and outputs we can do everything which is inside here good yeah so that's it for the introduction. Thank you very much for listening. Have fun with the curse. Have fun with the videos. Yeah. Maybe one one thing is left. There are not only the videos. Yeah. For the pupils who are attending this because of school. Yeah. Because of my school. Because. There is also there is also uh, a script for this. So we'll, you will have something written. Yeah, you will have something written there, and it's called MB for Maschinenbau FE Fachspezifische Informationstechnik 010. So the first first uh, uh, chapter. It's called Arduino. Here we have all the things inside, and you always have also the link to the to the corresponding uh, YouTube to the corresponding YouTube video. Okay, to this corresponding video, you just you're just looking at. Good, yeah. Now it's really time. Yeah, now it's really time to say goodbye for this time. Hear you next time.